944 is your time, and Joe Bell, starring Mark Wahlberg and Reed Miller, hits U.S. theaters today. It's based on a true story that made headlines in 2013. Good Day's Buck Lanford got a chance to talk to the stars about this emotional film and the message they hope people will take away from it. Hey, Lola, checking in from Idaho. I'll call you again from Twin Falls, okay? I miss you. Hug Joseph for me. The movie is based on the real-life story of Joe Bell, played by Mark Wahlberg. Bell was an Oregon man whose 15-year-old son, Jaden, committed suicide after being bullied in school and online for being gay. It's a complicated story of relationships, grief, redemption, and more grief. I've been walking and trying to figure out why my son did what he did. It makes sense out of the part that I played in this decision and just like... How different is it to, to prepare for and to play a character in a story such as this that's real life as opposed to a fictional character where it's, I guess it would be completely different, or at least it would seem that way to me? Well, there's certainly a lot of responsibility that comes with that, especially to the Bell family, to Lola, uh, to Joseph, uh, Dusty. You know, I felt... Um, that I wanted to make sure I could really do an honest depiction um, through all my research about who Joe was. And he was a very complicated guy who had a very tumultuous uh, relationship experience in childhood with his, with his dad. And, um, you know, he's working with limited tools and skills that he had in, in raising Jaden. But um, you feel an overwhelming responsibility to, to do the family justice. You're beautiful in your way because God makes no mistakes. You're I'm on, on the, the right track, track baby. baby. I was born this way. What? Well, don't look so surprised. Excuse me, I didn't know you knew the words. Reed Miller plays Jaden, a role that forced him to tap into his own real life experiences dealing with bullies. What are the, some of the key things that you learned about him or that you really wanted to come across or portray when playing him? His kindness. Uh, that was something he was really, really known for was his kindness and just being unapologetically himself. And for me at the time, um, that was kind of a challenge because there are a lot of scenes in the film, a very confrontational scenes where Jaden responds with kindness as opposed to aggression. And there was a lot of improvisation in this film um, and just saying what was from the heart and sometimes leaving the script. It's a dramatic film and the underlying messages are many. If there's just one thing you remember today, you make it this. We're all in this together. And I think the most important thing is to have empathy and to, to want to understand each other. Um, no matter what. What do you hope people get out of this film? A lot of things I've learned uh, here. A lot more love. Nobody but me for coming. A lot more love. Understanding there's so much divide now, just bringing people together, opening their hearts and their minds. And of course, parents really supporting their children for who they are, encouraging them to be themselves and communicate uh, when they're dealing with issues um, that could cause any kind of mental health problems, you know, really being able to communicate. Hold on to the ones you love and you love them for who they are because you may not get that chance again. Buck Lanford for Good Day Atlanta. Now that script was written by Larry McMurtry and Diana Osana, who also adapted the screenplay for Brokeback Mountain. Joe Bell is in theaters today.